what's good YouTube today I'm gonna show you how you can make a plug type beat and this is like very spacey version of plug type beats I don't know something for Boofpack Mookie yeah shit like that some spacey dreamy shit and you heard the beat in the beginning so as always let's get right into the piano roll and I'm gonna show you how I made this okay so I don't even know what the fuck I did to be honest I think I played this in with my MIDI keyboard so I don't know about the music theory let's just listen to that and see what it sounds like yeah what can I say to this bro just a chill melody with some notes in between to make it kind of bouncy and shit and yeah, that's it for the piano I think I layered this yeah I layered this with a sound from Purity so these are the same notes but different sound and this is a pad yeah then I edit this I don't know what this is from something from purity bro I don't know what went through my head with this one but yeah that's the melody and then this should be a string yeah so just copy this over and as I said in the last video bro, Vienna strings too, these are my favorite ones, I take them for every beat, yeah, really fire sound. And then I went with this, yeah this is the oboe. And then I made this one. This is the bell pad. Oh shit, I think. Yes, yeah, sir, this is the oboe sound, but I copied this over uh, to the spell pad and just added this top layer. And then I copied this bell pad over what I copied from this oboe. Uh, into this sound and this is another pad bro I'll be using so many pads for these type of beats yeah bro really spacey then I did the drums yeah just something bouncy bro don't go too crazy with the higher draws and shit. I mean you can do it, but if it sounds good, you can do it. Um, but yeah, in general, don't go too crazy with the drums, especially the hi-hats. They should be like simple and bouncy. Then after adding some snare and perks, did the 808. And for space plug, or even dream plug, I don't know what you call it, bro. I don't care. Um, I'll be using the sub 808 the most. I mean for some beats I also used uh, like a normal 808 you know what I mean but I think for a space block it's so much better to use a sub 808 because yeah. then for the mix uh, EQ out the frequencies add some effects if you want bro just play around with it and yeah he queued out the drums. I put down the perks, like from the volume and the snares also because they are uh, way too loud for me. And I also put down the whole melody in volume because the vocals guy have some more space on it. Then I made this EQ for the master. I took out the, bro, so many mid frequencies and even the bass effect because I want this sub effect to even be uh, more present than the space effect and yeah the fruit decompressor bro classic 
classic for me. I be using this in every beat, <laughs> and yeah, you can copy this if you want. Try it out, and then just a few fruity limiter, where I put down these knobs, and yeah, so the beat doesn't go over this zero mark. Then I also added this mute effect. So this is very uh, common in like plug music, and I think this really fire. <laughs> hits way harder yeah now comes the sad part because the tutorial is over and <laughs> uh, yeah well wow, this was so bad i'm sorry um but yeah the, you can actually get this loop for yourself when you check out my newest plug loop kit i'm gonna put it in the description and you can cook something up with this i got way more loops uh, in the kit and as i said i'm gonna leave a link in the description I will also preview a few of the loops right now and then you can see if you fuck with it want to download it I don't know and yeah bro you can even tap in of me in IG I work with everyone bro just DM me and say let's work or something like that <laughs> then I'm gonna send you some loops you send me loops and yeah we cook some beats together um, or even make some songs if there's a rapper watching this what I doubt but that's it for the tutorial bro always keep the grind up and see you in the next video